Last time on Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. Court is now assessing for the trial of Mr. Will Powers. Last time I'm saying that, Mr. Will Powers. And now, back to objecting to people. Just do it, it'll turn out okay. Hey everyone, it's been Day 98 here, and I'm back from Morphinex Right. It is uh, January 3rd, 2019, when I'm recording this. So I'm trying this new experiment where I'm recording an OBS from recording the audio and the commentary at the same time. So separately, I have been doing for this game. To help with edit, help with switch up the sound. Hopefully, it works. So I'm gonna do this again. Right here, here we go. Here goes nothing. So far, so good. <laughs> Turn about goodbyes. Day one, investigation. Let's do this. Yes, about that. Yes. Fifteen years is a long time to wait. Imagine how much I suffered. You, you suffered. Perfect opportunity presents itself. At last, I shall have my revenge. What? Merry Christmas. December 25th, 10 a.m., Ryan Co. Law Offices. Do, do, do. <coughs> hey, hey, Nick! Spirit medium training? <clears throat> of course! Except I've been slipping off lately. <clears throat> I need to brave the elements and be forged anew under the rushing spring waters. Darn! 
sorry, but them the them's the breaks. Can you just take a cold shower or something? Hmm. Good idea. So uh, much for the rushing spring waters. Next in the news. A large unidentified animal was sighted at Gord Lake. The town is buzzing with excitement. The locals are calling it Gordy and Tip of the Hat to Nessie, the Loch Ness Monster. Though its na namesake Nessie it proved to be a hoax. Locals are confident their Gordy is the real deal. Me. Boring. Can't they show real news for a change? Like my, like, like my great trial record, three in a row. You go down to the fire department and have them spray you with the hose. Hmm. Good idea, Nick. Apparently, ESP has no aiming, detecting sarcasm. <coughs> we interrupt this program to bring you a special news bulletin. Strange occurrences of you at Gord Lake, but this time, it's murder. Gord Lake again? The body of a man was found in the lake early this morning. A suspect was apprehended. Sources inside the police department revealed that the suspect's name is Miles Edgeworth, age 24. Edgeworth was an up and coming prosecution attorney known for his skill and connections. He was guaranteed a long and rewarding career. Has he thrown it all away? News at 11. going on? Edgeworth would never do something like... Nick! Yipes! Maya! The fireman yelled at me when I called him. We've got bigger things to worry about than that. Arrested Edgeworth. What? You mean the prosecutor? Yeah, he's a suspect in a murder. What? When, where, who, why, how? I don't know. Let's go find out. Well, what should we do? What do you mean? Let's investigate! We should, check out, we should talk to Mr. Edgeworth and check out the crime scene! You're right. You're right. We need more information. Save aimless and confusion for later. 
campaign with the sick user later. Well, got any good ideas? Not really. I do my best to keep on staying underneath the waterfall. Carry this. You know, I think it's supposed to be a nice luster. <laughs> okay, I'll look at your pants later, Nick. We got work to do. I suppose you're right. It's in the center visitor's room. <laughs> you know, Nick, we've all been here in here one time or another, haven't we? I guess it comes with the territory. <laughs> I'm not sure we, it's something we should mention to too many people. Worth, come back. What are you? What are you doing? Good day, good day, Governor. Governor, what are you doing here? Nick, don't think he's in a very good mood. Well, he is in detention. Were you in a good mood when you were here? So, you've come... So, Governor, you've come to laugh at the fallen attorney. Then laugh. Laugh. Well, Governor, why aren't you laughing? Nick, should we be laughing? Nah, it's a trick. Laugh and he'll get mad or bust into tears. Edgeworth. We don't have so much free time that we can, we can spend coming down here to laugh at you. <laughs> Meep. Yes, you do. Actually, he's right. I hoped you would have come. I didn't want you to see me. Not like this. Not like this. Hey, I didn't want to see you either. Believe me. Defend you. <laughs> oh, good one. Good one, right? But I'm not that hard up. Not yet. What do you mean by that? Me, trust a wet behind the ear lawyer with only three trials under his belt? <laughs> Never. What? My 
case is near hopeless, right? Every defense attorney I've talked to has turned me down. What? Simply put, they were afraid they'd lose. It occurred to me that it may be my fault they lack confidence. After all, I didn't get every single one of their clients that they're guilty. I don't believe it. Regardless, I don't want you involved in this. You in particular, I cannot ask to do this. Edgeworth, tell me what happened. Why should I? What are you going to do about it? Da! We're going to help! That's what! Help you! That's what! Me? You? Don't be ridiculous. Sorry? You're a novice. You've only been through in three trials. Hey! Sure, you got lucky and, and won all three. Your luck's bound to run out someday. You're real skilled, right? Experience. You, Nick, Nick. Why am I always the one who has to get angry? Angry face, Maya. Attack. The murder took place at Gord Lake, correct? Yes. Late. Yes. Late last night. is a long way from your offices and the court. Why were you down there? Nope. I see no need to tell you. Mr. Edgeworth? You, you didn't really... Gordy. Huh? I went to see Gordy. Gordy? What's that? I'll tell you later. I want Edward to talk to us. hard for me to ask. But you didn't do it, right? 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 Right, right? Think what you will. I only have one request. Huh? Stay out of this case. I know, I know that, but I don't want your help, okay? Look 
just go away and leave me alone. I don't want, I don't want your green eggs and ham to go away and let me be. Maya, let's go visit the gate elsewhere. But Nick! This guy wanders the visitor's room. <laughs> it was an since I came in a real pro. For the camera. No clues here. Number twenty fifth. Gord Lake Park entrance. Gord Lake is in the middle of this park. I can see some police walking around in there. Questioning people, probably. Hey, isn't that Detective Gumshoe over there? Well, pal. <laughs> isn't that this here, pal? You want to found anything? Sorry, sir. You did nothing. Idiot! Idiot! The trial's... Idiot! The trial's tomorrow! We need clues on the double! But... But, 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 sir... There were any clues. That's why we arrested that attorney, Mr. Edgeworth. Sir... Shut up! Shut up! Just you, just you try to say that again, pal. I'll, I'll, er, I'll make you sorry if you do. I mean, let's get out of my face, pal. Yes, yes, sir. Detective Gumshoe was kind of scary today. Recruits, pal. Hairy guy, <laughs> you're that. Hey. Hey, pal, you're that hairy guy. Hairy butts. Right, Phoenix. Right. Please never ruin my name. What are you doing here, pal? And what's the game? Uh, um, well, yes, I suppose. <laughs> I'm here to help. That's the easy you want. Bring it! He seems different than usual. I wonder what's up. Um. Mr. Edgeworth um, actually hasn't asked us to fit him yet. Huh? someone who needs it. Detective <coughs> Gumshoe. 
do you know what happened here? Huh? You don't know, pal? No. Wow. Wow, okay, Mr. H Mr. Head in the Fluffy Pink Cloud Warrior. Head in the, huh? Never mind. I'll tell ya. It happened last night, about 15 minutes after midnight. There's a boat about out on Gordon Lake. In that boat were two men. <laughs> One of those men shot the other with a pistol. arrived on the scene and arrested him. How did he get there so fast? Well, there was a wit there was a witness. When the report came in, we raced to the lake. A witness? Absolutely not! Absolutely not, pal! It's impossible, pal! I don't care if it's a witness either. I don't believe the lick of it. Right! Who cares what the witness says? I care. Neep. <coughs> you really believe in him, don't you, detective? Of course I do. But the police are pretty sure he, the police are pretty sure he's the killer. Nobody's really even taking this guys that seriously. Somebody has to live around here somewhere. Oh, this will have to do, I guess. All the help Mr. Edward has been to us. Hard to imagine no one hard to imagine that no one's saying enough to take his side. Well, at least you are detective. At least you are. Is it true? No one will take Mr. Edward's case. Yeah, pal. Yeah, pal. Yeah. He's a bit of celebrity. If you defended him and lost your reputation, you should have suffer. What's more? The, the case against him is, is, well, it's pretty solid. Solid pal. Suppose it would be if they have a witness. Hey, pal! Don't turn, don't, 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 turn, turn your back on him, too. Remember the still samurai? Mr. 
Edward has helped you to get your client declared innocent. I, I, I know. I went to Edgeworth. I tried. You really want us to represent him. Especially not us, he said. What? What? What, pal? Hold on, Vicky. You said so. Oh, wow. It's right there in my... It's right there in, my, in front of me. I didn't see him. Wow. Whatever. It wasn't supposed to make any sense, pal. It's like these cough drops in front of me. It don't make any sense either. Where, where, where were they like five seconds a minute ago? Pal? Eesh. You should, heard talking about, you should have heard talking about you after the Steel Samurai case. I kept saying right, right, right over and over. Meep. Nick. I'm not sure that's a good sign. Let's huh. let's up strong. Neither am I. Why, why would he want your help, pal? I don't get it, pal. Who is this witness? Er, er, sorry, pal. That's confidential. Anyway, the witness is all everything. Apparently. I'm sure they'll try to have the trial tomorrow. Was there only that one witness? Yep, it was pretty cold on the lake last night. It was Christmas Eve after all. Still, we're being thorough. You never know when you're going to turn up another witness. That's why we're here check today, checking things out. So far, we're turning up empty. Day. Oh, it's Christmas today. I'd forgotten. Don't know how. Where's my presents? Nick, give me my presents. <laughs> what are you giving me for Christmas, Nick? Talk to Santa. Nick is going to sure. What? Find something? Oh, no, sir. Not yet. There's a call for the priest link. They want to hold an investigation briefing. A briefing, pal? Hmm. 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 Right. Right. I'm off. Oh. Sorry, pal. I guess you heard. I gotta go. Is anyone help me before I head back? Well, yes! Yeah, you have the victim? Sorry, pal. They haven't got the autopsy report yet. I'm still waiting for it myself. Actually, Take the time, drop by the priest think. You talk more than there, pal. You came back, detective? And I'm probably not, pal. So what so would you have someone talk to you about? Alright. Yeah, I'll say how to get down to the priest think. Come, come down and see me anytime. Nick, I'm sure we gave you the, the direction of the police station. Oh, hey, you have to come too. What? Uh, we'd like to take a look around the park. We walk around? Yeah, no problem, pal. You got my permission. You know, Nick? I think there's something to be talking. <laughs> I think there's something to be said to talk.
talking for talking to people when they're busy. Yeah, they don't, they don't find, they get, think about giving you information, not giving you information. Right, now let's get investigating. December 25th, Gord Lake, Public Beach. Wowzers, this is Gord Lake. Yep. I'm not sure it warrants, it warrants a Wowzers, though. Who are you, Inspector Gadget? Wowzers. Samurai dogs. I want a samurai dog! Please! Please! I bet they're great! Well, they, like samurai dogs, how could they not be? Trash can is empty. This place is well maintained. Wow, Gord Lake is really big. Yeah. Say, Nick, why is it called Gord Lake? Oh. Well, a long time ago they used to grow gourds here. because the lake looked like a gourd when viewed from above. You know, like an hourglass shape? Well, this is like a gourd, actually. That's just a coincidence. Oh, okay. I'll not stand. It's closed. Christmas friends looks a little half baked. So better read samurai dogs. Somebody needs to redecorate. Huh? One of those, one of those poppers here, you know, pull the string. And it goes pop. Yeah, I know the ones. You see them around. You see, you see them a lot around New Year's. Hey Nick, it might be a clue. Let's put it in our handy dandy notebook. No, Maya. No, no blues clues. Come on, admit it, you just want to pop it, right? Was it that obvious? A popper, hmm. I'll take it, it's mine. I suppose it couldn't hurt. Huh, where'd it go? Or put it in the pocket. Poor 
brick woods. September 25th, Gord Lake Woods. I like it here, Nick. Look, someone's camping. We've got guts coming at the scene of the murder. true, Maya. That's true. Good call, Maya. Let's go talk to him. Let's see if we had seen better days. It's it all over. I can't believe they don't want to drive their, call, drive their car down here. Hey, Nick! <laughs> what? Don't tell me you're hungry again. No! No! Well, kind of. But I was just wondering why the Kevin pots are, and pants are made out of aluminum. They talk about... They didn't talk about that in his law books. So there's no law saying they have to be made of women then? I'm having this conversation. The sign says no camping. Funny place to, to, pick, to pitch your tent. Said those same tits on fire. I don't think they have signs like that. Oh. There's some food and macaroni on the sheets. <coughs> takes, takes, takes a pretty tough skin to camp it out in this cold. No clues here. What about this one? This camera has a mic and some sort of attachment. It must take pictures when triggered by a noise. Well, cool. Let's try it out. Maya, jeez. Maybe it's not set to respond to voices? Well, what then? I know! A party popper? Yep! It responded. Whoa! Now, there goes a whole roll of film. Ah, what? Huh? Sorry. Sorry, nice. Sorry, nice. <clears throat> Sorry, nice. Sorry, nice. You don't pay my bills. You know how much that roll of film cost? I'll pay you back. What were y'all thinking? Say, I'm a party pooper. 
a party popper. I think I have a party popper. And a party popper in a place like this. Ah, uh, well. What? What? Don't y'all, don't y'all try to play stupid with me. Because you think I'm some country bumpkin. Yeah, I know how y'all, y'all yanks think. I say the southern folks talk with the like, exaggerated drawl. They must, by then, be done. Well, let me tell you, because I might be dumb, doesn't mean we all are. Nick, help! Uh, who are you? N now, her chaperone? Uh, yeah. Just figure out, just, just figure out what y'all are going to say and say it for Jesus' sake. God, I, I'd rather listen to this my Papa Strauss than listen to you say it all day. Oh boy. This piece of paper of the film. Watch it! Yes, ma'am! Second thought, I'll, I'll pay later. I'm really sorry! I heard this is my badge. Huh? Aren't both those people all shiny and impressive? You a cop or something? Um, I'm a lawyer. What? <laughs> y'all, you all ain't gonna try to pull one of those watches on me over that film now. Cause I'll have you, cause I'll have you know I'm a fighter. I wrestle mere fucking things than you. No, that's not it at all. We're here investigating a murder that took place on this lake. A uh, uh, murder? Sounds cool. Why y'all? Why y'all sit down in the first place? Go ahead and ask me anything you like. I don't want some cooperation. You too. Y'all can come out of hiding now. I won't bite hard. Come to think of it, where did I get to? Sorry. I was feeling a little overwhelmed. The culture gap and all. Never you mind, honey. I can talk yank for ya. If, um, if, if it pleases ya. Great, great then. I'm, I'm Lada, Lada Hart, you can, but you can call me Lada. I'm here for photography and I've been here showers for a research project. Mighty pleased to meet you. that murder anyways. I ain't seen much television lately. It happened late it happened late in the night on Christmas Eve. Is that so? Is that so? Christmas Eve. A man on the boat was shot. Did you see anything? Well let me see. But you say I reckon I might have seen one. I'm not sure though. 
y'all gotta remember, I've been watching this here like for a good three days now. I, I kind of see enough boats to chuck a meal. Kind of hard to remember which, which I've seen when. You don't really want to know that, do ya? Actually, actually, I'm a researcher. Country. Research student down at Country U. Right at the heart of the heartland. Wow. Neat. Nick. He's a researcher at a university. Country U. Uh, so I hear. So, so when did you come up? So when did you come up here? Hmm. Hmm, let me get, let me see. I guess it was about three days ago. What are you photographing? Didn't I tell you all? Didn't I tell you all that already? Meteors. Yep, meteor showers. Falling stars. That's quite a camera you you have there. Y'all better y'all better know it. It's a German made. A genuine sewing nerd. You know they make knives. Um. So what's the device you have stuck to the camera? Huh? Huh? Device? It started moving all by. It started moving all by itself. I fired my party popper. Oh, that, that triggers the, oh, that yell, that triggers the sutter when it detects a certain sound. It's probably going to pick up loud voices right now. A, pro a programmable camera? Neat! Well, this camera adds to the detective the court record. I'm not going to take what picture and the loud noise detected. It is the lake. Oh. Lada. Yeah. So, your camera it triggers on loud explosive noises? Uh, yep. Actually, the, the victim in the case we were researching, he was shot with a pistol. A pistol. Right, now one of the gunshot make a similar noise to our party poop, <coughs> pooper, popper. Hmm. I guess it would. Your camera didn't get a picture of the murder, did it? Hmm. Hey! Y'all pre pretty bright. Huh? I see what you're saying. Tell you what, I'll have, my, I'll have a good look and see my film. It would have been a photo taken late last night. I checked them once. I don't remember if anything on them though. 
But what if I got something? I could get a witness to a genuine murder. Yeehaw! I'll go check that film. Y'all come back now, you hear? See what, see what inside your SUV? Yeah, she should come back later. Twenty fifth, police department, criminal affairs. Leap. I guess he's like the dumb show still not meeting. Hey, this is coming down, pal. Do you think? You think it's gum show? We just finished that meeting. For better or for worse. I got the feeling we're some bad news. You know anything about the victim yet? No, no, pal, no. So can I identify him? So can I ID him, pal? Has Mr. Edwards said anything? Not a, not, not a word, pal, not a word. So, how did the meeting go? I can't, I can't tell you, pal. You're a lawyer. True. You know, pal. I don't, I don't know what to believe anymore. Sure, Edward's a human like you and me, you or me. Still. I get the feeling if he's done something wrong, he wouldn't go hiding it. That's just the kind of guy he is. What can you all see that? So they think Mr. Edgeworth did it? Well, well, pal, the trial is starting tomorrow, as scheduled, pal. I see. Um. Hey, in the end, you didn't tell us about the, the meeting. Don't go tell you, don't go tell you about the pal. Y yeah, yes, sir. Uh, and do me a favor, pal. Stand by, Mr. Edgeworth. He needs your help, and you're the ones to help him. I'm sure you got some reason why he won't talk to us. Detective Gum 
don't you? How come you trust Mr. Edwards so much? Well, pal, well, pal, I think I, I thought it was obvious. We got a strong relationship, us two. We trust each other, and that's how it works. A working relationship? See, see, Mr. Edward always gets to be declared guilty every time. Yeah, his message might be a little extreme at times, but there's a reason. He trusts our investigation. See, he, he see, he trusts us to get the right man, pal. So I work extra hard, pal. We've got to earn that trusty place in us. Mr. Edward, but man, you can trust, pal. And you have my word on that. I was wondering, did you ever hear the autopsy report? Oh, that, pal? I made a copy for you, pal. Uh, after you report the court record. Thank you. Huh? Can you show me the photo of the victim? Hmm. That face. Someone you know? I don't know. I just have a feel the feeling that I met him somewhere a long time ago. Time of death, someone on the 24th or 25th caused one bullet shot to the head, to the heart. So, so I'm running a blink right now. I wonder if she's done. I don't know if she, I don't know if a lot is done with the thing yet. Was like woods. Ah! Hey, hey, y'all! Lana! Wait up a sec! Wait up a sec! We got bingo! Bingo! My, uh, cam I on that camera took two pictures last night, y'all. This is them. Take a look. Ooh, wait. See, see, it's, 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 it's seeing them with that pistol. It, it looks like that. Yes. But you can look at the fellow who's who that is shooting. Well, yeah, y'all, there's enough fog out there last night to strangle a bullfrog. But you know, seeing these photos remind me of something. What? Ah, something better happen. I'm a witness. Are you serious? 
choice. How do you forget? Never mind. Y'all recognize to tell the cops? I can tell. I reckon so. What's that? Now, don't try y'all, don't you all try to get my Friday accent. I'm a sensitive lady, y'all. Hey, so I'm also going to tell the cops the cops. Get all this, get all this photograph. Ladies. Wait, wait, Lana! Well, y'all, can you see I'm busy, kind of busy? T t tell us what you saw, too, please. Not try, honey, but I wasn't born yesterday. I'm a witness. That means I'm on the side of justice. And that means the cops, y'all. I'd seen her eat the southern side of the northbound skunk and tell you. Lana! Don't let y'all your skitties in a bunch. Friends today, enemies tomorrow. Or what's the other way around? No matter. I'm gone, y'all. Hey, hey, maybe they'll let me do some testifying. Hot darn! Ma, you cry a lot. You're a teenage girl. Well, that's one more witness. What do we do now, Nick? Well, if you saw something, no one's going to do about it. The question is, what exactly did she see? We'll get to find out on the trial tomorrow. Like photo added the Court records. Hmm. Oh, what the police have given up their questioning? Hey. Long time no see, Nick. Nick, you know Santa? Well, Nick and St. Nick. Hey, I see a connection. <coughs> Don't be ridiculous. Dude, dude, it's me. Uh, Larry? What are you doing here? Isn't it obvious? I'm working my day job. I sell samurai dogs. Want one? Can't get money for dates, you know. My girl Candace deserves the best. Candace? Not in the model, I hope. Oh, Candace is a fine, fine woman, Nick. It was, her, it, was, it was her idea I wore this costume. She was all, you girl girlfriend, you know? She bought me this costume for me. 
That, that's great, Larry. Wow! A Santa costume! You must be really nice! Whoa! Whoa! Well, cute! Nick, who is she? She's not your... Not my... what? No, 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 she's not. Sister? Well, Nick. Well, Nick, it must be tough. Working nine to five, having to take care of a little sister. No, 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 I'm not Nick's sister. I'm my older sister's little sister. Huh? <laughs> Sounds great! Don't worry, Maya. He's not listening. Huh? That's your trade's bad, isn't it? Dude, you really helped me back with that trial. Sorry, I can't really pay you. Because you blow it all on candidates. You can have all the dogs you want. Really? Larry. If you let her, if you let her at your dog, you want to eat the other customers. Hey, hey no problem. That makes her happy, you know? You know? How many times I try to remind you that it was me who I got to the hook? Hey, hey, Larry. There was a murder here last night. You were here. Have you heard anything? Nick, you wasted your time. Last night was Christmas Eve. He was with Candace, obviously. But if he's staying out here in the cold. Oof. Oof. Meep. I think we, we just had to call him off guard, Maya. No, 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 it's just Candace is not really in, not in town right now. She is in uh, Hawaii on a photo shoot. A model. I knew it. Well, anyway, there was a murder on the, here on the lake. The trial's tomorrow. Huh? Neat. Defendant is Edgeworth. Miles Edgeworth. Um, Nick. Why would Larry know Edgeworth? Well, 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 Nick. Y you don't mean that, Miles Edgeworth? Old oh, edgy? Yeah, he's a murder suspect. What? Whoa, murder? Huh? You know Mr. Edgeworth, Larry? Yeah, of course. Ed edgy, edgy was in the same class as us in grade school. What? Um, I'm telling you about the dogs. Huh? Oh, you mean the samurai dogs? What? Why are the samurai dogs? I mean, they kind of look gourd shaped. Uh, oh, well, originally they're like. Well, originally they were, they were like guard dogs, you know, you know, like guard dogs. Ouch! The Samrock thing was 
It was like Kenny's idea. Yeah, she's my woman, you know. She was all change the name and you go, girlfriend. She made she made me that banner. Man, kids can't get enough of those samurai dogs. Um, something about that just seems wrong. And uh, guess what? We get a lot. We get ton of customers here that like that big news. The big news. Yeah, Gordy. G -g 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 Gordy. So, Mr. Edwards, what's your request, bit, Larry? Yeah, me and Nick used to hang out all the time. Wow, I never knew. Can't get me wrong, he's always been this kind of stick in the mud. Saying all the time, can I be like father? Like his father? Yeah, it, yeah, it was Papa, the famous defense lawyer back in the day. Well, wait. You said defense lawyer? Yeah. Wait a second. But Mr. Edwards is a, is a prosecuting attorney. What? What? Edwards got a proboscis on his knee. No, no, no. He's a prosecuting attorney. Let's go up to the defense lawyer. Huh? Huh? Yeah, figure. Yeah. He always talked about the. He always talked about the 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 weak who were unable to defend themselves. Man, he's to go on and on about man's duty society and all of that. What a bore. I wonder what changed his mind though. Do you know Nick? Huh? You mean you don't know? It's here. It's here. It's here the very lake. The giant mysterious monster. Gordy. Uh, monster? Yeah. Check it out. This is a tour from yesterday's newspaper. It's a photo. News: Giant life form appears in Gord Lake. Uh, um, yeah, it's probably just a log or something like something, right? Hey, there's a quote from the person here. Took the, took the photo. Hmm, what's this? I set the camera to automatic, and we got in the frame. I heard a loud bang, like, a, like an explosion. Followed by the sound of something slipping into the water. I would like to have seen it! Why would there be a sound like an explosion? Larry! Can I promise an article from you? Say it, say it, no problem. That'll be one million dollars. One million? Grow up, Larry.
what is it? Oh, nothing. Something's been bothering me. Can you shove that on top to you for much more? That office. Wait. You mean Grossberg's office? Right, that guy. That's the last thing I expect to come up. I guess I talk to him for old time's sake. The 25th, Grossberg Law Offices. Ahem! <coughs> oh, boy. Ah, that old familiar thing at the throat. Oh, your, your Myers. Something, are you not? Me is something, are you not? I, I wish I understood it, yes, Phoenix right. Uh, and you're, me is something, something too, are you not? <laughs> You've grown. You come look. You come to look a lot like your sister. You know. <laughs> it takes me back. Ah, oh, the days of my youth, like the sin of first women. You see. Um, uh, Mr. Westbrook, sir. Hmm. Uh, uh, oh yes, I beg your pardon. Of course, you came here to do something. What is it then? Something that matter? You really grew up the past few years, my dear? How proud Mia would be if she could see you now. She said she was more worried about me than anything. I'll just go and take the compliment, will ya? What happened? There was a murder last night. Uh, a murder? You haven't heard? I uh, just got up, you see. Well, Miles Edward shot someone with a pistol. Edgeworth, what? H who? Well, the identity of the victim is still unknown. This is terrible news indeed. Yes, he hadn't heard anything. Mr. Grossberg, whatever happened to that painting? Ah, yes. I do not think it's ever be coming back home to this office. I can't actually claim, actually claim it is stolen. I suppose it just, it, it, my, just desserts. Old bitter desserts.
Hmm, strange. Hmm, I feel I've seen this man somewhere before. Ah! Oh! Did you remember? He was a lawyer. He was a lawyer. Here, in my office. That's Hammond. Robert Hammond. Mr. Hammond? Mr. Hammond? <laughs> and you say this is the man that Miles Edwards shot? Who is this Hammond guy anyways? <laughs> Mr. Hammond? He was a defense attorney in that case. That case? Yes, the DL6 incident. DL6, why does that sound so familiar? Perhaps you remember? I'm sure someone mentioned that during the trial for Mia's murder. <laughs> that was the incident where the police were so at a loss. They used a spirit medium. Meep! Wait, you don't mean... Was that medium my mother? <laughs> yes, my dear. The spirit medium, Misty Fay, your mother, contacted the spirit of the victim. But the case was a loss. No conviction was made. The deal incident, yes. Happened 15 years ago. A very strange case indeed. You never caught the criminal, right? Correct. Misty Fay, Misty Fay, use your powers to talk to the spirit of the late victim. For charges, your testimony is that charges being laid against one man. Mr. Hammond won the case and so it was declared innocent. Mm. And the police played my mother, calling her a fraud. You were the one that helped her out then, right, right Mr. Gosberg? Uh, uh, yeah, 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 yes, yes, quite. Thank you! No, 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 please, don't mention it. DL6. Never thought I'd hear that name again. But... What does that case have to do with Mr. Edgeworth? It has everything to do with Mr. Edgeworth, my dear. The victim in the L6 incident was none other than his father, Gregory Edgeworth. What? 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 His father? Meep. If you want to know more, you should ask him yourself. Show him this. I'm sure I'll talk to you. Wait! This is a photograph of my mother! This is Faye photo as of the court record. Color. 
Lee Payne was hanging there recently. How am I doing? Uh, well, he gave it to someone. I pay it to some romantic entrance. Love, love to tell Nick. Uh, yeah. Or he gave to the guy that's gonna murder you, murder your sister. Let's head visitor's room. Governor, what's this, Governor? I was hoping you got my message the first time. Uh, Edgeworth, what about your what, Edgeworth, what about your defense? Yeah. Not the center of yours. Governor, not any devout one yet. Edgeworth. Gadna, only been a matter of hours since your last visit. Since. Yet, you made credible progress in your investigation. I'll admit it. I'm impressed, right? You always were a single mind in your work, though. Once you start on something, you always see it through, don't you? About the DL6 incident. Right, DL6. I don't want you I didn't want you to find out about it. That's why every future offer to defend me. I'm sorry if it sounded like I was you thought you were up for the job, Governor. I just want to keep you away from DL6. So, is it any better for me to stay, stay away? I don't know, but I see no point of hiding from you now. Very well. Ask whatever you, ask whatever you like. I'll be answer the best of my ability, Governor. Gavna, the L6 incident was when my father died. Right before my eyes. He was shot and killed and I saw it all. Mm. My memories from that time are, are, are foggy. I suppose it's a self-defense mechanism. In any case, the subject was arrested. A man. It's pretty clear he was the only one that could, could have killed my father. The spirit medium they used to talk to my late father said the same thing. attorney by the name of Robert Hammond that cleared my father's na subject's name. And Hammond is the victim of the Gord Lake murder? Correct. Um. That spirit medium. That was my mummy. What? You mean your? Hmm. It's strange. Gavin, I thought that terrible incident was about to end, and now this. About to end? 
DL6 incident happened 15 years ago. 15 years ago, on December 28th. The birthday of Vendelia 1998! Yay! December 28th? December 28th? You mean Vendelia 98's birthday? Oh my god, that's, 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 that's a, like a natural holiday! The statute of limitations in the case went down three days because, because you know, murder, murder is a statute of limitations apparently in, 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 here. What? Um, Nick, what does that mean? The case's statute of limitations runs out. Legally, the case never happened. Three days from now, three days from now, the L6 will be closed forever. What happened to the suspect? It was like, got off innocent. Yeah. Gana disappeared from the public view. No one knows where to. If he's still alive, he'd be about 50 years old now. I guess I understand why you go into hiding. It'd be hard to live, to live a normal life after being a suspect in a murder. A suspect in a, a, such a big case. Um, so was your father a lawyer? He was. Gregory Edgeworth. He was quite famous at the time, apparently. So uh, you were trying to fall, trying to trying to fall, to follow in his footsteps. Mm. I really don't talk about it. Hmm. I just thought there'd be a photo. Edward, did you shoot him? What do you think, right? I don't think you're the kind of gun, kind of gun at anyone, no. So you didn't shoot him? No, I didn't. Wasn't me. Yeah. Right. Yeah? Pains me to ask you this now. I know he wants to defend you. Yes. Of course we. Of course we won't. Ha ha, loser. Nice no, game. Of course we will. Ah, uh, I guess the day would come. Not me. This is my chance to finally pay you back. Pay him back? Pay me back? For what? I don't remember anything that was anything for you. Never mind. I guess you really don't need to know. Huh? <laughs> um, my little request. Please get to go take the gun shoe. Should request to put in his pocket. Well, I guess we should. I think it's a, it's a big one. Wow! Coming down. Phew, that was. Phew, that was scary. Huh? Huh? What's that worth? Frame 
I guess we're done. Well, I guess we're done! You know what I'm like to set up anytime soon? Let's go, Nick! Uh, right. We have to give Edward what I request to detect the gumshoe. What's going on here, pal? Eek! What's wrong, detective? Pal, this follow lady came here just a while ago. Says he came to, to talk to y'all after hearing what Mr. Bright had to say. What, what's all this about, pal? A lot of heart. Why are you going around for... Why are you going? Why are you going around finding more witnesses, pal? You'll give Edward a death sentence, pal? No, 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 not at all. Just, I mean, she did see something. There's nothing we can do about that. I can't go around covering up evidence. Yeah. Trying to say what's that? You you trying to say something about the way I do my job, pal? No, no, no sir. So, what did Miss Hart say? She says she saw Mr. Edward fire. She says she saw Mr. Edward fire that pistol, pal. What? She even had a photograph to prove it, pal. Right, I saw it too. But you really can't tell from the photo who it is, who it is shooting. That's why, that's why she's, she's, she's going to the photo, pal. She said I'll drop the quality of mic, but but should tell, let us see who's who. She can do that? She can do that? Okay, it's going to be a, a, a large photograph that shows Edward in the, in the act. Great. Just great. In any case, pal, she's the one. She's, 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 she's gonna be the one testifying tomorrow. Huh? What happened to the other witness? Well, apparently, there's a cancellation, pal. Cancellation. I'm afraid tomorrow could be life or death for poor, old, poor Mr. Edgeworth, pal. We got a witness who says she saw the very moment of the murder. We got a photo that was taken when the shot rang out. That sounds like a pretty unwinnable case. But wait, what did me used to say? If he's innocent. There's gotta be something I overlooked. It sounds like Mr. Edgeworth is gonna ask the state to sign a public defender. Pal? I was just asked to file the paperwork. But you still got time, pal? We'll talk to him again. For me, please! You have to convince him! You have to make it let him, you have to make him let him defend you. Please, pal. I don't, I don't think anyone can do it, pal. You're the one that can save a dreadful, pal. Well, actually. Surprise. Look what I got. Why wait the last minute to follow the papers? I was about to start new ones for you. Thanks, detective. Is 
Who court tomorrow then? Good luck, pal. Hey. You guys saw earthquake a little while back? I was worried, pal. I was worried. We're fine. I was out here my whole life. I'm pretty used to them by now. I wasn't, I wasn't worried about you two pals. I was worried about Mr. Edwards. Oh, right. You seem to have reacted a little now that you mention it. Yeah, well, I'm not surprised, pal. It's a pretty big quick, pal. I'll have to check on You You eat and get your rest for tomorrow's trial. Later. Hmm. I wonder what it is with Mr. Edwards and earthquakes. Hmm, I wonder. We never that scared of them when he was in school. Then again, I was only in the same class as him for fourth grade. He transferred to another school after that. I wonder what happened to Edgeworth. To be continued. Yes. I. Oh, that was. Part of my voice. But it was a pretty long one. Let's see, let's see, let's see what happens next time. I'm Phoenix Wright, his attorney. Turn about goodbyes. Never stop learning. And enjoy the randomness. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.